Hi, I know many of you will still have mortgages uh, and you may be worried about the increases in mortgages, mortgage rates that we've seen over the last few months. I'm recording this in October 2022. So I want to give you maybe a tool that you can maybe help work out what future mortgages payments are, also what changes in mortgages will be over a period of time. So I've got a spreadsheet for you, which is a, called a loan repayment schedule. Uh, and let me talk you through it. So here we have, here's the loan repayment schedule. So uh, I've got a loan amount of £300,000, an interest rate of 2.67%, so kind of quite typical on what people have been able to uh, get in the last few years. Borrowed over 25 years. Um, I put down this mortgage lender, the borrower, sorry, the borrower has borrowed the money in October 2020, a couple of years ago, and their regular schedule is £1,371. And the total interest, if they keep paying that 2.67% interest rate, the total interest is £111,503, 111503 So what would change? Let's see if interest rates go to 5%. I'm going to watch what the scheduled payment is, 1371. Interest rates go to 5 and it goes up to £1,753, so quite a significant change. Okay, so that's the jump that people could be seeing. Let's go back to the 2.67%. And what could you do? Well, maybe you could afford a little bit extra now, early on, before those prepayments go. If you could afford £50 a month, uh, or £50 a week, sorry, a couple of hundred pounds a month, maybe, um, over payments, 300 that is, I'll just put that to 200. Um, you can see that that is reduced reduce the, um, uh, if you continue those payments at that interest rate over the full 25 year of the mortgage, that saves you four years, just over four years off your mortgage, actually 51 months. Um, okay, so 2.67, um, so if we go that to five, take that to five, again, and you can see that the 1,753, the total interest there is 179,000 pounds. If I take out the overpayment, that goes to 226,000 pounds. So of course, you may be able to increase your mortgage term with your lender. You obviously, you've got to approach your lender and find out whether you can do that. But obviously, the, and you can see the difference in interest payment, total interest payable, 279,000 there against um, the 25 year term. 279, 226. So of course, the extra five years, you're paying significant more interest. I thought this spreadsheet might be useful to people so they could see the impact and the change in interest rates, the um, opportunity to maybe make overpayments, and of course, the alternative of extending your loan out to a longer period to maintain affordability. So it just gives you a bit of a tool to empower you to kind of make some sensible decisions about if you have some spare money, what do you do? How do you apply it? Where's the best place to save it? Is it an investor? Here's a tool available to you. I'll put a link in the downloads below where you can get hold of it. I'll put um, one for an Excel download, but also one for Google Sheets. Um, so you, whichever uh, software that you use, you'll be able to access. I hope it's useful to you. If it has been, and this is a video that you've enjoyed, please press the like button and of course subscribe so you never miss an episode. Thanks for watching. Bye bye for now.